Just a stone's throw from the hustle and bustle of Edinburgh's Princess Street lies the quiet corner of Old Colton Cemetery. Amongst the graves there, you'll find a magnificent memorial to the Scottish-American soldiers who fought for freedom in the American Civil War. It's a bronze figure of President Abraham Lincoln standing on a granite plinth with a bronze figure of a freed slave at his feet reaching out to him. The names of the six soldiers commemorated are inscribed on the plinth, including that of Sergeant Major John McEwen. It was the tragic story of his widow that inspired the memorial. She had called at the American consulate in Edinburgh to apply for a pension following the death of her husband. The wife of the American consul, Mr Wallace Bruce, took an interest in the story of her brave husband who had fought in the Civil War, returning then to Scotland to a life of sickness and poverty, and then finally being buried in an unmarked grave. Wallace Bruce organised a committee to raise funds for a monument. Mr George Bissell, himself an army veteran, was chosen as the sculptor, and Edinburgh Town Council provided the burial plot in Colton Cemetery. The memorial was unveiled on the 21st of August 1893. Despite the very wet and windy weather, a large crowd had gathered. Sir William Arrell, chairman of the unveiling ceremony, said in his opening address, We have here on this monument the statue of a statesman, a great statesman who stood up for freedom and liberty and the integrity of the empire to which he belonged. And I hope that the monument will stand here as an object lesson for all time to all Scotsmen to stand up as that honest statesman did for his country and for his freedom.